Jesus prays for unity, he also prays for protection. We can pray for protection too, especially in the coming weeks and months as we all make decisions about what and how to resume and find the right balance between freedom and protection from further infection. We can and should pray for wisdom in all of this. There is though something more here. Jesus is sending his disciples out into the world, into this new reality without him, and and he prays that they may know the unity and protection that come from knowing the word and truth of God, and which enable them to witness to him in a difficult world. Jesus says, sanctify them by the truth. Your word is truth. The truth is is that God is in control. Jesus is on his throne and sends his Holy Spirit to be with us. More about the Holy Spirit next week, of course, at Pentecost. The truth is that we're safe with Jesus. Little Johnny may have thought he knew the whole truth, but of course he didn't really. Jesus does, though, and his truth is the only one that matters. The truth that even in an uncertain and new reality, we can be confident in him. So why not join me now, like Jesus himself, in praying for unity and protection as we prepare to enter into a new and different reality? Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for your word. Thank you for Jesus' love for his followers. Thank you for your love for us, 